playing against Crystal Palace. Let's see. I will need a stronger defense next season, bro. This defense is very weak. The cameras are fixed to one man. It Hello, it's great to be with you. And no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's the absolute mad lads up against Crystal Palace. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And the lineup for the home side. Well, they're playing with a 5 2 3, as we can see it here. But I think at times we'll see one of the centre backs. Oh, opportunity here, Stuart. Blocked it brilliantly. Had a chance to whip it in here. And a throw in it's going to be. Just cutting off the supply. Well, sometimes we have a fierce relegation battle, sometimes not at all. And barring a miracle over the run-in, it looks it's pretty clear bro. I have to be going bad down now, Stuart. Ten points, Unfortunately, bro. Derek, the table doesn't lie. The teams in the relegation zone just haven't been good enough. It's it a simple like as that. Like a zone team in the second half of the season, And bro. I'm hearing there's been a goal in the full of the game. Ferreira guy is world-class. It's a goal for Fulham. They've scored the open-up with 11 minutes on the clock. Cheers, Alex. And Ramirez has it. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. Ooh. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. Cutting the ball back. Nicely blocked. Trying to pick out a teammate. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this. No, man really and bro, what are you expecting to see? Is very tough, bro. Is like the he's their leading goal scorer and his general play in the top third of the pitch has been so clever. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. The fans are shouting, shoot! Closing down well. No. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Costa with it. Just five goals, bro. He was and so world-class last season, man. It's so crazy. And the lads have possession again. Making progress. Could be. And there Come on. it is. Two goals Very in a nice. matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Christoph Baumgartner. Nathan Ferguson. Well, let's join Alex Scott, shall we? Because I'm hearing the situation has changed in the Everton game, Alex. It's a goal for Arsenal. It's all even Stevens at 1 1 with 27 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. Svanberg. Baumgartner. And Palace will get the throw in. <laughs> They're subbing them all, bro. They're like Time very for a change, then. harsh. More than us. Christoph Baumgartner. And a good mad lads move in the making. Will he play it in? Electing to shoot. A oh, tremendous block.
Now it's with Boateng. And back with Ferreira. Showing good width here, Palace. Almost at half time, and they're making home advantage count. I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Yes, it's been a really energetic display from them so far. The passing's been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half time. A bit wasteful from Palace. The stoppage time situation. One minute here. I have to be comfortable without the position. Bounder. That's all there is, bro. That's all there is. That is that. If you're comfortable without the position, then you can win. I'm telling you, bro. Don't even feel like I've given half. Done. And the ball is running again. Palace left with a mountain to climb here in the second. Oh, big chance! And just Ooh. narrowly wide in the end. <laughs> Superb defensive Out. judgment no. to end the attack. Right, what's happening at the London Stadium? I believe there's been a goal there. Alex? It's a goal from Manchester City. They're back level. It's one all with 46 minutes played. Thanks as always to Alex Scott. A goal here! Can a goal. Have seen precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay. And just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Three goals without reply. Banks. Costa with it. Svanberg. Can he convert? Well, somehow the goal. We'll get him back in form, bro, before the. And there's the delivery. And in. Oh, yes. <laughs> exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Oh, surely. And he's kept it out. Fully different. stretched, somehow reaching it. They favoured a short one here. Played into the box. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Costa with it. And that's great work to keep it in play. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. What can he do with it now? That's a good looking shot. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. If you've lost your keys. Nice looking pass. And a goal! The mountain goal we can do. They just can't subdue him. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal.
goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. Costa. Nathan Ferguson. Christoph Baumgartner. Really good challenge. Superb looking pass. Would have delighted oh, had it gone in. So a personnel change then. Right, I'm hearing something important has happened in the West Ham game, and Alex Scott has the details. Another for West Ham United. It was a breathtaking finish. A shot from such a long way out. I think it totally surprised the goalkeeper. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 71 minutes played. The fans are enjoying what they're seeing here today, Derek. Alex, thank you very much. A long way out. And still an opportunity. There it Come is. On. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. De Frey. Svanberg. Just 10 minutes remaining here. More live football to come. A little note about a future game with us here on EA TV. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. And there it is. We a goal. A complete but round, be man. Purely yeah. a consolation at this stage of the proceedings. They haven't been at the best. Well, wow, there's a really stylish piece of running. Cordoba Determined defending There will be three minutes added on at the end. Cordoba. And tidy Come defensive on. play. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, what a great display nice that performance, was. Bro. He really did inspire... Not from the goalkeeper. But... I always like this goalkeeper. Always has a shit game. See who they show. You are good, bro. That's all about it. We hit the peak, bro. But he's been a very useful player for us. We won't give up on him. Not yet. 
we will keep trying look at that price might have hit the peak might have been Try then why are you just to rest, bro? What is wrong with these people? Impossible to do this, bro. Not be more than ten thousand, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, man. This is impossible. हो गया नाइस वेरी गुड लेट हिम प्ले ब्रो इफ यू वांट टू मैं कौन फोर्स हिम
I don't really feel like playing this game to be honest. I just play it bro, no point of might win. This is it. A can't miss game. Well hello and a warm welcome from the gateway to some of the most picturesque scenery anywhere in England. We're at the Vitality Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And with the Premier League season about to reach its conclusion, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Bournemouth against the absolute mad lads. Well, what a season it's been, Derek. We've seen everything. Drama at both ends of the table, some spectacular goals and plenty of entertainment. The players, of course, will be looking forward to a break now, but hopefully not before they give us a good game today. And the starting 11 for Bournemouth. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. Mm. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, it's certainly a back four, but I think we'll see a lot of rotation in midfield. They just need to have a good understanding about when to support the front player and when to drop that little bit deeper. It certainly looks like a 4-5-1 to me. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with two, oh. particularly in no. tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Cordoba. The cross is on. And he takes it away. Attacking options appear plentiful. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Well, they've given him too much space. Well, possibilities in the centre. Abraham. Cuts it back. Tammy Abraham. Electing to shoot. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Well, the crowd know that set pieces could be their best chance. Just listen to that reaction. In a dangerous position. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, news to bring you from one of the other games, and big news at that. Here's Alex Scott. Yeah, it was a penalty for Brighton. Luck was on his side today. Ooh. Compared. It's now 1-0 with 25 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Wow. Come on. Well, 
Well, the absolute mad lads now in potentially a dangerous position. Well, very effective play in possession. And foul it is then. Must take the lead here. Okay. And they have. You've got mm, to say happen. it has been coming. Really good strong tackle. And it'll be a throw in. And news of a goal in the West Ham match. And Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for West Ham. They're the first on the score sheet here with 31 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. Zappa. And nicely over the top. Composed and patient passing. Who can he pick out? Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more oh, of that. It's okay. It's always going to be like this, bro. It's not going to be easy. I have to just start. Romain Fevre. Abraham. And a textbook interception. And a good looking pass. Sebastian Cordova. Polava is having bad game after bad game. Tammy Abraham. Romain Fevre. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. And the referee has awarded the free kick. He tried to play advantage, but it wasn't forthcoming. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Pervis Estupignan. And the referee blows the whistle. The first half is in. No, do that, bad ball. So the second half is underway and work to do for the absolute mad lads. <laughs> Fevre. Difficult to stop him. A well, fine reading of the situation. And the clearance over the byline means a corner. Well, they've decided to make a change, favouring the short one. And a fine stop. Well, they fancy a short one. And continues his run. in the center and a very good challenge right over to you Alex Scott tell us about the goal that's been scored at St Mary's yep another goal for Southampton they're ahead by two now with 53 minutes played thanks as always to Alex Scott Abraham It has to be! Really good piece of goalkeeping there. And pressing from the front. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Well, he's not had a good first, has he? He's lacked energy, didn't get on the ball enough, and at times looked off the pace. 
Mind you, that could apply to the whole team. They need oh, to Stewart, score. an opportunity. He had to score, and he does. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Tammy Abraham and he takes it on and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save Ninety four percent bro Oh that rocker is nice man 58 and one playable bro Well they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change Benoit Badiashil. Stopped a sure fire goal. Oh, such an elegant nice. finish. How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. He must finish. Corner coming up. Big chance it is. Oh, yes, a goal. Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Estupinian. Right, I'm just hearing in my ear there's been a goal at Villa Park. That means we send it over to Alex Scott. It's a goal for Villa. It was a low driven cross into a crowded area, but he was there from close range to finish that move off. It's now 1 0 with 73 minutes played. The fans are in good spirits, Derek. Oh, hang on, Alex. Big chance here. And a goal. Oh, they just keep believing. Who's to say they can't do it now? Well, the ball moving again, and you sense the momentum may well be with the absolute mad lads now. Jelovic. It's offside, Ooh. and perhaps he should have been a bit more alert. That's crazy. A 15 goals, man. That's really just good. Too static. Substitution time it is here. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Mm -hmm. Well, goal news to bring you from the Everton game. Alex Scott has the details. Yeah, third goal for Nottingham Forest. They're now behind. Bar very one good, bro. They're very good. Played. Alex, thank you very much. Jelovic. Ah, crazy man, that's very good. Just listen to the noise inside this stadium. Surely this will inspire the players to hang on. What a noise we've got. And cleared away, a corner kick it'll be. There's no way out man, that's really good bro. I'm like very surprised by how good they are. Pavlovich. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. This could level it. Ooh. I tried, man. I tried. I really did try. That was not a bad performance. Had a chance to whip it in here. Shot block, but still alive. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Nice. And that is the end of the contest. And not Good performance, bro. The important thing is I created more chances. Contest, side Two, yeah, of course. I mean, it's fine. I'm like, I'm deep. used to it, bro. It was an inconsequential game anyway. They won the game. Anyway, bro, it's okay. Just a couple of questions for you. Yeah, he's not a good player, bro.
thank you for your the keeper is a huge issue bro he's a complete clown because oh the fuck it's a lot of money bro are we ninth yeah it's okay i mean see we would have not made it into the top anyway but the goal away is like the highest in the league almost on the worst defenses in the league we missed out on but that's crazy like 24 points man i was like 5 10 points ahead i feel like we were just really bad in the final part of the season Okay. Might play like a normal center back. We love to keep him. Playing anywhere. Jelevic should have scored, bro. He's not a good player. Man. I'm telling you, he's like a complete clown, man. Bro, we need like better players. We'll have a lot of money to work with next season. A different team all together. He was very good. Play. He's a very good player. Man. Chelsea man, so very strong. Five star, bro. It's gonna be a tough game. Okay, welcome everyone. Uh, we'll start with the questions now, please. Thank you. Nice. 
Nice. No, bro, we are not playing Jelevic. He's not a good player. Ah, oh, man, come on. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. This is fine, bro. Let's see. Okay, guys. Best of luck to me. It is a special occasion and always one to be cherished. Who will go down in history as the winners of the FA Cup? They were very strong team. Mopenda, man, I hate TV. this guy. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular mm. effort. Chelsea versus the absolute mad lads. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Joe Gomez plays with Jose Maria Jimenez in the center of defense. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. This is what they'll be facing. Okay, come on. Today. The long play look a very balanced team. The three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the center. Yeah. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. focus on many of the back pages coming into today's game very much on him and the reports have been confirmed he will in fact end his career at the end of the season no two ways about it Stuart a big and it might be and a goal So good, man. Should have scored. Good ball to switch the play. Come on. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Doing well to keep possession. An attack full of promise. Is it going to be? And a goal! I tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Ben Mal. The Mad Lads moving the ball forward. What can they do with it? That's a corner. One. That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. Jimenez. Fabiano Parisi. Pass 
passing it accurately. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. The attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. position and teammates to play it to you can almost see their opponents racking their brains how do we stop this the Chelsea move still flowing advantage to them well, good the keeper is not having a good game bro I should have you know, brought him back from loan right, whatever guy and then played him approaching the absolute mad lads trailing how would you sum up what we've seen so far well they're certainly not out of this they've created some good chances and look threatening but they need to be better defensively in the second half which is part of to concede again if you're wondering about stoppage time one minute to be added on that's a good ball mm -hmm. We can really only two shots actually. We weren't even that bad. I think it's always like that. Zero point nine. I'm telling you, man. I need help. I need luck and help and shit. I can't play like that. It's very difficult. Well, it's advantage Chelsea. We just had two chances, bro, and it's full board. Tight call. Well, that was really close. It was almost the perfect run, wasn't it? That's going to be a double substitution. In position here to protect the ball. And a throw coming up after that authoritative challenge. Fabiano Parisi. Chelsea will get the throw in. We have 30 minutes to go. What can Chelsea do from this position? A well, disappointing end to the move. Now can they 
more and the absolute mad lads within touching distance here and it's gone out of play under real duress Lambert could play it in it's got to be Short. Comfortable in dealing with the cross. And the lads have it back. Almeida really well played pass now who can he pick out this could be the equaliser oh, come on Point. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball has ended up in the back of their net. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Openda. Fernandez. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. Progress made by Chelsea, and at this late stage, a goal could be decisive. Teammates available. Oh, wait, 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 wait. A good save, bro. I'm not a fan of him. I'm not a fan of him.
possibilities. Ooh. Really getting stuck in. Oh, cool. But Chelsea on the attack near the end. Oh, no. Oh, OK. Boy, to God, bro, he's saying this in here. No, 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 no. Bro, this Jimenez guy has had the game of his life against us. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. Come on! Moving the ball forward, what can they do from here? Oh, great vision. Well, good work from the lads to win the ball back. And now, come on. Bro, yeah, look at that. It was like pocket of space. No letter on the pressing front. Jimenez. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. The first period of extra time Nine. is over. Fifteen minutes left. Maybe after that penalties, we'll see. Well, the second period of extra time commences. What drama do we have in store for us? really well to get through well, the absolute mad lads have it once again might be a chance to break Almeida well, keeping the ball as they're doing is helping the cause that's useful play Oh, put it behind for what will be a corner here. And played short. And a 
Cross goes in. Well, nothing on toward happened. Time is against Chelsea, but they can still battle back. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Oh. Quite muster a real threat. Good Chance Lord. maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Beautiful pass. Come on! And surely that's the end of the story. They cannot throw it away from here. Not the scoreline we see all that often. 5 3. There will be one minute added on at the end. Will he play it in? And the cross fired over, but no real central pressure applied. Come on. Finally, bro. It is a story of silverware secured. They've done it. They certainly have, and they deserve to do it as well. They were the better team today. Tony Lever, bro, that opened the guy. He thumped. He had one shot, bro. He would have told that I would have lost my mind, man. Seriously, bro. He did a good save, man. I'm actually happy for once. Like, I get it, he was still not perfect. But, yeah, we need a bunch better, bro. I know, but still, like, a keeper, man. 60 40. I'm telling you, bro, it's not about how much possession you can keep. Finally, bro, finally. Some questions regarding the match. Thanks so much. What a fuck. It's done basically, that makes sense. Oh, yeah, boy, he's such a good player, okay. He's done his job, man, like seriously. Very good. 100% upgrade in price. Oh, it's okay, man, it's okay. Okay, guys. Ah, uh, thing will play. Okay, we'll play later, guys. Good fun today. Very close. Very good. Very happy.